Demonstrators gathered outside of Alumni Hall to protest the presence of National Socialists and white supremacists on campus at UNF. And they're compromising the safety of almost every student here by allowing someone who threatened to bring an assault rifle on campus to stay on campus. The group No Nazis at UNF was formed as a counter-protest in response to members of the National Socialist Movement and Ku Klux Klan demonstrating outside of Ken Parker's discipline here. Is this the cracker bomb? Are you scared of my cracker bolts? Is that what it is? Pretty much everything is, is threatening these days on these campuses. I mean, everybody's a snowflake, it seems like, anymore. And anytime they see a picture that offends them, we've got to get ourselves a safe space and a little cuddly animal to keep us comfortable. The disparity in attendance for either group was staggering, with about 70 people associated with no Nazis at UF and a mere four in support of Parker. The counter-protesters gathered outside of Hicks Hall at around 8 a.m. and marched across the street at 9. No fascists! No KKK! Several guest speakers were present, many of them UNF alumni and faculty members. Fight back against the racism, bigotry, and ignorance represented by the reactionary white supremacist movements. Thanks to the efforts of the university police department, demonstrations remained peaceful. And we really weren't too concerned. I, I feel like our students here are respectful and they understand that um, they, they have a right to protest and I respect that. Parker's discipline hearing was not open to the public, so the results have yet to be released. We will continue to update the story with information as it becomes available. This is Tom McCormick, UNF Spinnaker.